Hey guys, it's Mr. Cloth here, and today I'm of this Monster Legends Week's video. I have a bunch of new leaked events for you guys, as well as a brand new Mythic moveset and a new Mythic design, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Alright, so the first leaked event we have is the Matriarch Breeding Event. This is for the monster that we went over yesterday. This is his full moveset if you want to pause it and look at it, but I'm not going to go too far in depth because we did just go over it. But basically, it just does a lot of baby reversion, and it has a lot of good support moves, and deny moves, and resurrection moves. So yeah, just an all-around really amazing monster. And the breeding combo for this monster is going to be Sir Valgar and Anorika, Lord Nabotis and Anorika, or Sir Valgar and King Charmless. And it will also be inside of a fraternity event, so if you or anybody in your team buys gems, then your whole team will get the monster. And what's really cool about this breeding event is that Sir Valgar and Anorika will actually be inside a monster witch. So you'll be able to watch ads and then breed the two monsters that you get from the ads to get the monster. So yeah, definitely do this event. Matriarch seems like a really good monster, so he's definitely worth getting. And then we have a new monsters moveset. This monster is actually going to be the free-to-play bounty hunt monster for next week. So let's go ahead and see if he's worth getting. Alright, so the first decent move is probably Let's Go Crazy. It applies triple damage and vulnerable to itself. That move can be really good if you have like a turn transfer that removes negative status effects so you could just use this and then turn transfer over get rid of the vulnerable and then he just has triple damage and then there's dirty cut deals very heavy metal damage to one enemy applies bleed to one enemy that's nothing special but very heavy metal damage is good and then mechanical horses applies artifact hater double damage and precision to itself that's a pretty good move and then break and shred applies artifact hater to itself deals a massive metal damage to one enemy that's a pretty good move and then x layer deals very heavy metal damage to one enemy disables trade on one enemy and then deals very heavy metal damage again i'm not sure if that's a typo or if he actually does it twice but if he does it twice that can be pretty cool and then a special applies vulnerable to one enemy deals insane metal damage to one enemy removes 50 percent of total life for one enemy so you basically just kill somebody that is a very good special and of course he's a metal attacker with artifact hater and high damage skills this is going to be a very good monster a lot of the monsters that have come out recently have had artifacts so this monster will counter them all and then we have a new Algator loading screen which looks pretty cool hopefully they keep up the good work with the loading screen so they've all looked really good recently and then we have matriarch's design so this is going to be the monster that we just saw the breeding combos for and it looks a little weird but i guess the design doesn't really matter if it's a good monster so yeah definitely try to get this monster it seems really good but the design is kind of weird so those are going to be all the leaks for this video don't forget to like share and subscribe for more videos like this and i'll see you guys in the next one goodbye